Good morning everyone, it's your boy Marcus Place. Uh, and we are now back to the oh, what Oh, les lignes, les bien à fond, hein. As you can see, guys, every fucking corner of this. They're everywhere right now, bro. I'm fucking serious. This is ridiculously too many. Uh, sorry, I'm not gonna have Edwin on my team right now because he is probably going to work or maybe doing something else. So that's why I'm actually doing this myself, just real quick. It's not gonna be that long. It might be only like a half an hour video. I'm already uploading the yesterday's video with Edwin. All of the voice glow. Welcome back! You motherfucker too! That didn't work very well. He's literally, he's the same dude that walked away from me.
Gonna drink some coffee. Oh, it feels so fucking good to have the snooze again. Ah, motherfucker. It's the fat motherfucker. I'm using it. But I didn't want to use it, but I had to. I see some sun from me here. Fuck. That was not what I wanted. I did actually want to have the. Energy drink or something. Uh, okay. Fuck this up, I guess. Yeah. I was kicking the fucking ass. Somebody's having a bad day. Haven't you said that before? Like a guy in the pool? Up there also? I have to look for health. There is something. Jeez, there's so many IDs. You alive over there? Ah! No. Of course not. <laughs> he said. Jim, look out! Someone's coming. Quiet. Our friends. Oh, they've come for us. All was quiet. And then, and then everything, everything went crazy. A mob of prisoners, prisoners attacked Titus and his men, and then the undead came, attracted by the screams. Moment spirited us away and traded his boat to Alvaro, so that he would tell us how to find him. He was helping us endure the donation shaft when the dead got their hands on him. He sacrificed himself so that we could get away. There were too many. There was nothing we could do. They tore him to him like... Hungry animals, animals and, and all we could, could do is watch. watch. If, if not, not for no one, we, we would not be here. Rest in peace, no one.
The elevator's here. Okay, now, take a second to catch your breath. <laughs> Fuck, I needed the trailer. Be careful. Uh, what do we got here? Well, it doesn't actually make any sense if I'm. It doesn't help me. If I'm only looting stuff, you know. Because, uh, firstly, <laughs> I'm not gonna be needing it. But I need to. There we go. Uh, mm. I would really enjoy to have some some fucking life, the uh, health though. There we go. Now we have everything full, and I have four monotops. This that's just amazing, bro. We have to play this through with the Elvin. But we're gonna start in the jungle probably tomorrow. Whew. 
think I'm gonna be able to finish this game again alone. But as I said, we might be forced to play through the jungle part half of it since Edwin actually didn't play along. I can't play until 20 more minutes. about this part. I didn't actually die at all. I mean, last time I did this part, I did well die, I guess I did. Let me see what I need. I don't actually need this one, so I'm gonna have the grenade here. One shot, bruh. That's not right. That's a lot of money that I lost. Scheisse. I have 15 more minutes, like 17 more minutes. I have to be able to finish this game. Who's next? You think you can stop me? Yep.
could be nice if I had any fucking sniper. Stop fucking hiding, bro. Fucking Christ! And yes, it's actually morning, guys. And Edwin, I'm gonna say this in Swedish. Edwin, I was going to the last part of us, but we're going to do it together tomorrow, like. Så att du får vara med lite grann och se hur det är. Det är inte så jättesvårt men det är en del lite att göra. Try harder, motherfucker! <laughs> Why don't I learn? I can't die any, every time. I'm losing every money. This douchebag is going down! Yeah, I know. I'm just gonna use the infected. Fight fire with fire. I'm gonna show you fight fire with fire. Hey, 
yes. What are you trying to do, Colonel? I don't have to explain myself to you. Look, your wife is gone. Look at her. She ain't coming back. But you can still save Take us. Take step in your death. I have the cure, all right? The doctors in Sydney will make more. We'll send helicopters. We'll save everyone. With a nuclear bomb? Kevin told us the plan. You're gonna kill everyone. Maybe I should start with you. I have no choice here, right? This virus threatens the entire bloody world. But no, he's lost either way. It's easy to kill millions of faceless nobodies, isn't it? Stay back! They are all these people you hidden! Stop! But killing someone you love? It's not so easy, is it? Son of a bitch! <laughs> Så det är Edwin, det här är ett som kommer att hända, men jag hoppas du inte tittar förrän när vi spelar imorgon några då. Då blir det på kvällen då. I'm telling this in English because he might not know. There we go. <laughs> That's how you do. <laughs> That's how you finish the game. <laughs> Fucker. He was right about one thing. Benoy is lost. If not him, then someone else will soon send a nuke with our name on it. The quicker we leave, the better. I wish uh, we could go back to cinema right quick. Come on! According to officials, Benoit is still under quarantine. The sought-after vacation destination, popular with celebrities and wealthy tourists alike, was ironically originally a penal colony and still houses one of the strictest maximum security prisons in the world. It is home to many dangerous criminals and terrorists, including Karen, the infamous hacker for hire who has worked for everyone from Al Qaeda to the Yakuza. Karen is Kevin actually. The news of the lethal right? virus on the island has caused a worldwide panic. Some have claimed that the virus is only the first wave of a massive international terrorist attack and that the intentions are global. Bernard Green, spokesman for the Australian Defence Force, denies the claims. There is no basis for these ridiculous rumours. The entire island is under military quarantine, and the maximum security prison is completely secure. The hacker now is Karen, and every other terrorist in prison there isn't going anywhere. Humanitarian aid is on its way, and you can be sure that the virus, or whatever it is, will not leave the island. The whole world anxiously watches what is happening in Benoi. For the moment, all flights in and out have been cancelled. Oh shit, man, I can't believe we made it. At this point, I'll be goddamn glad to have all my old problems back. As long as the world is the way it used to be. It's not, and never will be. Trust me. I wonder what happened to Jeremiah in every fight after this. Uh, well, guys, this is it. I finished the game without Edwin now. But we will have to do it tomorrow. So, hope you enjoy and goodbye.